On Friday, the territory's chief medical officer of health, Dr. Brendan Hanley, confirmed the first COVID-19 related death in the Yukon. The death is connected to a family of five cluster in Watson Lake, which is in southern Yukon near the BC Yukon border. Last week, he reported a family cluster that was related to travel, though he did say the people in question did not travel outside of the territory. Dr. Hanley confirmed the person who died was older and had underlying medical conditions. They died at their home on October 29th while they were in self-isolation. Health officials say the level of risk to the residents of Watson Lake and other parts of Yukon remains low, and they don't suspect there has been any evidence of community spread. There are currently five active cases of COVID-19 in the territory, and since March, the Yukon has confirmed 23 cases of COVID-19. Since then, 17 people have fully recovered from the virus. Sarah Connors, APTN National News, Whitehorse.